Hi there, and welcome to A Day in the Life of Hotel Quarantine, New Zealand. Let's get into it. <laughs> So yeah, as you can see, I've been watching uh, the Olympics a lot, especially gymnastics. <laughs> been trying to do some on my bed lately. But anyway, let's do a quick room tour. Okay, so let's start with the bathroom. So really nice big bath, good shower there. Uh, we have a nice bathroom. And yeah, got you guys know what a dunny looks like, don't you? And... Uh, by the way guys, that was just the toilet seat uh, making a funny noise. Um, I've got all my clothes on, I was just uh, sitting down and, and showing you the toilet, which I don't know why, but anyway, let's carry on. <laughs> this is um, the toilet where we can see ourselves in the mirror, which is kind of funny. Um, yeah, I don't really look at myself when I go to the toilet, so it's kind of funny that there's a mirror there. And I'm um, getting down to me last legs of uh, toilet paper, so... Um, while we think of that, I might actually call up the ladies and let's order some more toilet paper. Yes, hi there. Can I please order some more toilet paper? Just one guest. Cool, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. It's on its way. A few moments later. Yeah, so I got my toilet paper and hand soap. Yeah, boy. Got me mask on. So let's take the mask off. Now that we're in the room, we can take it off. And we can breathe. We can breathe. doing now oh the room tour that's right so let's start with a quick room tour before we get into our day in the life of quarantine so there's my snowboard goggles <laughs> I'm so excited to go snowboarding that I tried them on now oh hey mate really good size fridge here like that's like bigger than those other ones you know those little ones the best part is when I first walked in here we got yeah I got two big beds so I'm so stoked and they are so comfy like I feel like I'm sleeping on a cloud. And then we've got a bit of space here. I actually walked 10,000 steps the other day up and down here. It took about two hours. I've got a big table and a chair. I've also put up some photos of um, my dog, my family, and just things that I'm looking forward to when I get outside of isolation, especially skateboarding. Look, this is my absolute favorite spot of the room. You get a chair. This chair is so comfy. I wake up in the morning, have my coffee, and um, I read a bit of my book, do a bit of journaling. So I can actually see the sky tower from my room. How cool is that? And I love it at night time because it changes colors. It's really funny, I can see people swim over there, like they're doing a bit of uh, swimming. The next part I love is the window. I can open up the window and get some fresh air, like so nice just to have a bit of fresh air when you're feeling a bit hemmed in. And uh, I can poke my head out the window and I can actually see uh, the water from here, um, the Auckland Harbour, which is really nice. And uh, you can watch the road workers doing their thing. So that's the room tour done. Um, I've booked in a walking space for 12 today, so I'll show you guys that soon. Um, but now it's 10 o'clock, so what I'm thinking of doing is some yoga. Every time people tell me they do yoga, I'm like, man, 
they must be flexible but so I've literally done yoga for the past three weeks and uh, I'm really loving it it's changed my life so if you're really stiff like me give yoga a go it's time to do some yoga let's get into it to get out of the roof. got back from my walk and it's lunchtime so I'm not too sure what today is oh here beef baguette and fruit let's go and have a look at uh... okay so oh what's this got like some salad stuff and, and yes I love it when we get apples <laughs> Alright, let's have a look at what's for lunch. So, I had like a little salad thing. And, uh, whoa, what the heck? Oh my gosh, yum. That looks so good. Well, I'm going to have some lunch and uh, watch my show. So, I've already had a few of these cookies. They came yesterday and I couldn't help myself. But, I want to show you guys these. Look, my friend Melissa sent me these. I don't know how she did it because A, she doesn't really know where I'm staying, so she's pretty smart. Anyway, they look a bit funny today because they've been in the fridge, but they are so good. This one's Whitaker's chocolate, so choc chip. I think we've got Oreo here. Um, I'm not sure what this one is. I think it could be cinnamon. And then we've got chocolate underneath. Oh, oh my gosh, and another one. Wow, she's sending heaps and then we've got another chocolate one yum thank you Mel so good all right so it is 3 10 p.m and I decided I'm gonna do some adult coloring in I'm not the best but you know it's really relaxing I thought it was for kids but Turns out you can buy adult colouring in books. So, yeah, it's just really therapeutic. Um, I would show you some of my colouring in, but I'm actually kind of embarrassed. Well, this one's not too bad. It's a 70s vibe book. That one there, colours aren't too bad, but this one. <laughs> Still getting to know the colours, but yeah. We're trying. We're, we're out here trying. So I'm going to do some of that and uh, yeah, hope you're having a great day and thank you if you're still watching this video. <laughs>
so this is my dinner tonight we've got tofu like a honey barbecue tofu here noodles and corn oh my gosh this looks like such a good meal and uh yeah i'm gonna have this and watch my show and yeah yum is it because our lives when now we're 17? Why does it always rain on me? Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what it's like uh, spending a day inside hotel quarantine. Uh, if you haven't already, don't forget to hit subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Take care and see you later.